Pokemon have just announced a brand new patch that will be coming to Scarlet and Violet in late April. We're going to cover all of the details in today's video. But before we get into the video, please subscribe to the channel. Remember, you can always unsubscribe later if you would like to. So on the back of all of the recent issues players have been experiencing in their copies of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, Pokemon have finally come out with some correspondence saying that a new patch will be coming to the games in late April. News dropped earlier this morning, Sarah B reporting it. A new patch for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet has been announced for late April, amongst other things, allows players who caught an egg instead of walking awake or iron leaves to catch them again in a new run of the raid. So players going into this raid who hadn't updated the game experienced a few issues where the paradox pokemon weren't actually appearing and an egg appeared instead of the paradox pokemon now if players went on to catch this egg that actually counted as their caught paradox pokemon meaning if they did update their games and then go into the raid again properly with the pokemon appearing you weren't actually able to catch these pokemon in your games which caused a bit of an issue of course so that will be resolved with this new patch. That'll be the one thing that will be resolved. Obviously, uh, there isn't really much else stated on the Cerebi website about the update, but it does state that the Terror Raid event will return around the same time as the updated patch. Um, and more details will come later. Now, Cerebi Joe goes on to say about the patch, right? So obviously people are wondering about the save data glitch and rightfully so. And that's the big thing that I think myself and probably the majority of the community are looking at for this patch and a few other fixes as well that weren't really implemented like was stated in the original patch notes. TPC are aware that I can guarantee as last week I messaged them myself about it, it's very, very rare. We do not know the cause, it's not go or buying the DLC. I and many others, including friends who are far more skilled than I at this sort of thing, have been trying everything to replicate to no avail. With us being unable to, I imagine Nintendo Game Freak would also be working to narrow it down. Patience is needed. So often with a new patch or a new game, we get reports of something causing save corruption. We had it with Skull and Violet, Sword and Shield, Smash, and so many other games and they went away or were explained away by things, SD cards, etc. We just need patience and hopefully an answer comes. So I guess the good takeaway from this is that Nintendo uh, Game Freak are aware of the issue and Pokemon are working towards fixing this save data glitch, which is the biggest thing I think on everyone's minds at the moment. There are obviously other glitches in the game. The one that has been addressed, particularly in this update, is gonna be that one for Walking Wake and I and leave so players can have the opportunity to actually get these pokemon in their games if they did incur those errors because of not updating going into the den and having that egg appear i would imagine with this patch and with it being scheduled for late april it will be resolving the save data glitch bug that we're currently experiencing in the games obviously if we get more information about this patch as soon as we do if the patch notes drop we will cover it here on the channel the thing that i would just like to say before we finish up we have covered this bug on the channel already and although it is a very slim chance it is a slim slim chance of it happening to yourselves i understand how people are worried and for context i have still been playing in my game with no issues i've been avoiding areas where i've had crashes before so if you've experienced issues in your game where you've had crashes probably best just to stay away from those areas i've had no issues online playing ranked battles or anything like that and i haven't been doing any of the vivalent postcard stuff either just on the chance that it could be something like that that causes this because like joe said and we mentioned in our previous video there's not one thing we can point our finger to and say that is what is causing this issue and that's what makes it a bit more scary but at least we've got the announcement now of a patch coming in late april and of course like i've said as soon as we get more updates or information on this i will put a video up on the channel and we'll go over everything so we've just got a bit more peace of mind and know what to expect when this patch comes out that's everything for today though friends thank you very much for tuning in i hope you found this information useful and at least we've got something going into april where we know a patch is coming have a great rest of your day and i will see you all again in another video so until then take care of yourselves and bye bye